Alright, so we are going to be able to finish up this recording in only three sittings. I'm very proud of myself. I only did this in three recording sessions. So, basically we're just freeing up the stages and oh yeah, we're also getting, uh, what are these things called? Scout flies. In order to get all 101 power cells. So, let's go ahead, let's do that. This episode, I mean, this level, was somewhat annoying because, well, first of all, you got platforms that look like a bunch of pizzas for some reason. I don't know if that's a convenience or not, but, um, music, I'm sorry, the background music was just kind of distracting me. It's pretty nice. And, um, yeah, like I said before, we're freeing up all the sages in order to get more power cells. And to stop going Maya from completing that robot so that way we don't have to have them take over the world, which would not be good. So you have to land onto the colored things in order to uh, not, like, die and whatnot. We got company, Jack! Lots of lurkers! Another freaking... What, what you might call it? Rampage or a, a ambush? Come here. Oh yeah, you gotta use y'all and red eco. Basically, all the ecos are going to be used in this episode. Ah, come on, bro. Oh. You cannot be serious. No, oh, Jesus, why? Phenomenal. Come here. Please do not attack me. Oh, there's two of them left. These things are so annoying to attack. Oh, there's three of them left. I did not realize that. I just don't want to die. I am dying! Everybody hates Chris. I hate my life so much right now. Oh my god, are you freaking serious right now? For, for, for real? Are we- Well, uh, better you than me. Come here. Oh my god. There we go. Oh my god, that thing was so annoying. Okay, now let's just wait for the thing to uh, come around. There we go, and jump onto there. God, I do not remember that level being that hard. That was just ridiculous. All right, and we free up the red sage, I believe, first. So let's get that boy out of here. Oh my god, that was, that was stressful. <laughs> you finally come to rescue. Do you know how long I've been in here? What took you so long? You know? <laughs> what are your names? I'm Daxter. He's Jack. He's with me. Whose man's is this? Good job, Daxter. You're a real hero. You've got to stop Gaul from launching the robot. I'll use my ego power to help open the shield door. You go ahead and do that, and we will be heading on down, helping out the rest of the sages, and also collecting more scout flies. All right, I forget which sage this is, but I think it might be the, yeah, based on the blue eco, it's probably the blue sage. We're not gonna worry about the orb. And the next launcher! Because we already have all the- Oh, Mr. Dax Launcher! Okay, Daxer, we, we hear you, but we already traded so many power cells. So that way, can Let me just grab some more do Eco, then jump on here. Again, you just gotta be careful to jump onto the next platform. Oh, God. Wait a little bit, grab some more blue Eco. Jump into the air, land on that platform, hopefully. Woo! That was a close call. Again, don't really care about the precursor orbs, but we help out another sage. Unless this is the yellow sage, I'm not sure. Well, we're about to find out. Who would have thought I'd live to see the day when I needed to be rescued by a boy and his muskrat? <laughs> I'm going to give Gall and Maya a little payback for this embarrassment. Then we'll see about cooking up some muskrat stew. 
Might want to watch out there, Daxter. So, yeah, actually, before we head on down, just want to go ahead and collect some more uh, scout flies. So let's just wait out a bit. Oh, God, this was tough. There we go. Just got to be patient with it. Then roll on over here. And voila, another scout fly. Okay, here's another scout fly that I apparently missed at the beginning. So here you go. All right, so we got the red and yellow sage freed. So let's go get the blue sage and then we'll go help out Samos. Oh God, this part was definitely very difficult. Having to actually correctly um, time the jumps. This part was definitely difficult as a kid for me. Oh crap. So, yeah, just pay attention. Definitely avoid the fire as well. And I ran right into it. Because why not? Camera in this game was definitely a little frustrating, but once you got the hang of it, it wasn't that big of a deal. go get on up here collect another scout fly that's just chillaxin all right roll oh god uh why why did i why did i do that seriously why did i do that just wait for it to get there then jump Woo, that was close all right and collect and help out the blue sage we have to also get two more scout flies in order to get our 101st power cell. Good work, fellows. Old Samos was right about you. Great piles of precursor metal. That insidious mechanical creation must not be allowed to wreak its terrible havoc. I will try to actuate the shield door by eliciting a conduit of energy between myself and the vast portal below. Uh, yeah. You do that. We'll, uh, just go find more help. Weird up! Yeah, that guy is a little... Uh-oh, we got more platforms to go help Samos. Basically, you just gotta climb on up here and just wait for the, uh, for the thing to come back. Then jump onto the next platform. Chillax here, and... Ah, crap. Alright, there's the sixth scout fly, but I don't know where the seventh one is. 20 minutes later. Alright guys, so I totally missed this seventh and final scout fly. It was right near where we were capturing the uh, red sage, and now that's where uh, the last scout fly was. I had to look it up just to double check and make sure so my bad about that I'm, I'm so stupid for not seeing that earlier but anyway we have 100 power cells we're about to collect power cell number 101 so let's go ahead to where I originally was and we'll continue from there all right guys here we go we're about to get power cell number 101 and go into this final battle with Golan Maya I even got red Gatorade for this bad boy so hold up a sec All right, gonna need all the energy we need, we can get to face Golan Maya's machine. So let's go ahead, let's do it. Flex on him, Daxter. Ugh. Good work, boys. You're real heroes now. I'll combine my green eco power with the other three sages, and together we'll open the shield door surrounding the precursor robot. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good start. And then after you guys open that shield, what are you gonna do about the robot? Nothing, Daxter. We have to keep the shield open. It's up to you two to figure out how to destroy the robot. Oh, great. I get to help the guy that turned me into a furball destroy the only person who can turn me back! First, save the world. Then we'll try to convince Gaul to help Daxter. You're too late to save us. Once I possess limitless dark ego, I will have the key to creation itself. 
This is madness! Madness? This is Jack and Daxter! Releasing that much dark eco will destroy everything we know! Just look what it's done to you! It has given us a beauty beyond anything you could understand. You two look butt ugly. What are you even talking about? Beauty? Have you two looked in the mirror lately? It's exactly Just what I said, wait Daxter. Until we open the silos, little one. You think short and fuzzy is bad. And to think you two traveled all this way for my help. Fools! Enjoy your fun row seats to the recreation of the world! Jack! Take the elevator up and stop that robot! And Daxter. Can't forget about him too, same mouse. <laughs> 